ourselves, but we are looking to work with an installer in the area, like Miami area, to pass off appointments or clients to. Um, Miami takes long in Broward, typically about a month, a month and a half. Okay. Worst case scenario two. Uh, that's just due to the regular permitting process out here. Um, but they're much faster if you guys wanted to uh, do sales. Uh, you guys are looking to push sales and pass on the installs? Yeah, or push. I don't know if you guys also have a sales team maybe push them some appointments for them to close and like get in the houses over there um sure do you run a like a ad campaign or do you guys are you guys a solar sales marketing company so basically both so some of the campaigns will get um will run ad campaigns but we'll also run just your existing data through one of our systems that does like SMS sequences or email oh, sequences. It. And then we also boost your reviews and do all these things to help build your brand in the area. Um, so one of the things, yeah, we do is run Facebook ad campaigns. So we'll get like $10 to $30 leads. And then we qualify them with, hey, this is how old their roof is. This is how much they're paying a month. And then they book an appointment in your calendar and then you sit down with them. Because uh, we can't be everywhere, right? So we right, focus okay. on helping grow your business, if that makes sense. As so you're a, also looking to fulfill your own installations or just that? No, as far as right now, it would be... Because, like I said, we can't be everywhere. So we just want to pass off some appointments to installers that are looking to take on some more deals. And how much? What kind of rate? Right, so we have a couple other or a couple things we can do. So we can do it per like performance. So we would take a piece of whatever uh, you guys are able to close, and then you guys just provide whatever volume of ad budget you want. Or we just do like a retainer thing where we'll just run the campaigns and the sequences, and then um, we're just kind well, of your marketing team. Kind of doing that on our own, but you are. We could try your lead quality. Yeah, okay. We have our own Facebook ads. So, as far as right now, what are you currently getting for cost per lead? Do you I know? don't know off the top of my head, to be honest with you, because I have one of my office manager guys who runs that. Oh, okay. Yeah, so our whole specialty is just focusing on solar leads. So all, all we right. do is generate... Basically, I can give you a good idea. We'll get anywhere between $10 leads and $30 leads. Now the $10 leads are gonna be more of like a, a funny video that has to do with solar or more of um, like an eye-catching video, but the $30 leads- Yeah, but would... you guys probably saw them through like 10 different companies. No, right? no, so that's why I say it's about branding and we only work with one company in the area because we use what we actually prefer to use is we have a we take like your pictures maybe like you outside with your uh installer team or you outside holding like your sign at your um office building and we run that as an ad because it's kind of the mom and pop experience and people like to buy from those who they they know and trust so the lead cost will be about like 20 to 30 dollars doing that way but they're high intent because they want to work with your company specifically and we actually have an agreement where any data that we, moving forward, that we agree to, uh, let's say, do a partnership where we're kind of your marketing and you're the sales, um, you own all that data. Even if we were to part ways, That's we cannot give that data to anyone else. It's tailored to you. I mean, like, if you want, let's do a temp, let's do like a pilot. I'm down to try a pilot. Okay. Like I said, we already have our own. We're not really looking to buy any leads because mm -hmm. we already have our own leads and then we right. have you know a bunch of sales guys that run around door to door etc right uh but i mean like i'm willing to try it if you mm -hmm. have extras I'm, I'm not supposed to not trying it you know so yeah if the leads are actually decent then i'll, I'll buy them and then maybe we can commit mm -hmm. to something Okay. But, uh, 
but right after rip i'm not looking to like engage with another company to be honest with you and and do all this like you know boarding and and all these payments and right but but yeah i mean if you have leads to to send us we can pay them and see how they go if they're good we buy some more Mm -hmm. okay so that is an interesting proposition so like I said, the reason why it's that is a difficult thing to do because we do it off of your brand. So we would have to run specific, br- like, a br- like branding your Facebook page, branding your um, offer in a picture, like your pictures, because we're kind of building your entire brand and back end system. Like we said, right, yeah. we yeah. already have that. That's what I'm trying to tell you. Right. We, do you? We, have a whole team that works on that Mm -hmm. so i wouldn't we're not gonna engage with another company that's doing that you know but we're down to buy leads Mm -hmm. you know okay well maybe you have maybe you have leads that are are general and you want to sell them if they're good right you know you I don't know if maybe they yeah, I mean, like I said, we don't give any of our other clients leads away. Even if we do split ways, it's all of their data, so we can't give any of that data. And we not we're not running our own campaigns for our own leads because we're not selling per lead. We could do that model, but the problem with that model is I'm sure you get all these people trying to sell you leads. Is we're not it doesn't go anything towards building your brand. It's not your funnel. It's not your organic traffic. It's not building anything towards your company. So you're just kind of giving used data to everyone else and you have no way of knowing. So that's why we only do it if, for instance, we were to build you the system to do it. Now, we don't even need to run ads. Say you're getting your own leads. If we were to work together, we would be able to look at what ads you're running and actually help you guys to be like, hey, we can get your lead costs down. So we would show you how to get your lead costs down. But we would also implement appointment setting structures. So for instance, immediately when a lead comes in, you get a, it sends the internal team, you guys, a text message, email, but then it also sends the client a text message, email. It lets the appointment setter know to, a lead came in and co- to call them. Then if they book an appointment. Look, I know about all that, but like I said, we already have a funnel system mm-hmm. that we exercise ourselves. Okay. So we're not looking to get to another one. But if you have leads that you want to somehow sell us, I'm down to try them. Okay. And maybe we can integrate to another campaign with you guys. Maybe you guys have better traction and cheaper cost to us. Mm So, you know, then we can transition to you. But I'm not going to drop whatever I'm doing and, 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 and try your your stuff when I don't know the quality of it or the cost. That is a very fair, a fair thing. Yeah. We don't yeah. ask anyone to stop what they're currently doing to get uh, clients, but we would just start building them another thing on the side. Um, but it's definitely understandable that you might be a bit skittish for trying something new. We also do like organic stuff as well, where it's get, like, how many calls do you think your company gets a day? Not yeah so typically there's about just say in the boca area a month probably 700 calls that um just in boca are available for solar companies and typically when you look to go get your hair cut or you look for the best food place you go with the place with the best reviews and so what we actually have is from your customers that um have not yet or they already purchased from you say they already signed up from solar we actually send them through a sequence a review sequence where it uh it basically sends them a text message and an email saying hey we're giving away a 50 dollars gift card this is how you enter how was your experience working with uh innovation homes uh services and then if they say it was good like past five stars they can write a good review if they say it's anything below five stars it just sends a message to the team with their criticism. So you only get five star reviews. So that will boost you organically to outcompete all of your competitors. And the reason why bringing this up again, we only work with one in the area. 
is because we don't want to help multiple companies in one area be their competition. It doesn't make any sense. So we only work with one company to do one specific uh, routine. So I'm not sure if that's something you might be interested in, but we offer that as well. Okay. So Can we... you send me something in writing? Yeah, well, I actually have like a quick demo if you have like 15 minutes, maybe tomorrow, to go over it. You want to go over it? Yeah. Sure. Cool. Awesome. What's uh, what's a good time for you? Let's do tomorrow morning at 11. Okay, cool. 11 a.m. And a good email? Good email would be Alberto, A L B E R T O, mm -hmm. at Innovation Energy Services dot com. Energy Services. Okay, cool. I'll send a quick uh, Google Meet here. Yeah, it's super simple, and it's not like super expensive it's not like running ad campaigns or anything because it really is just setting up a quick email sequence and um in sms sequence to your current customers and then getting them re-engaged because um, i'm sure you have a ton of data that's going unused for your reviews um cool so tomorrow... sounds good okay cool so i will send a confirmation to Alberto for 11 a.m. Perfect. Awesome. Let me know when you send it so I can double check. Okay, cool. Here, I'll just create it right now. Ten AM to ten thirty or eleven AM to eleven thirty. Should have got that. Let me double check. Cool. By the way, uh, while we're on the subject, do you have like uh, already uh, customer data to sell of customers that already been sold? See, no. We also do a track, and we're willing to buy a customer database if you have. I see. Of, cust of customers that are already done. So when we when we work with a client, all of it is all the data that we work together, it's on like a confidential agreement. So if we split ways to protect them and the, it's to we don't give out any other data with anything that we do um, because it's theirs to take. So, um, yeah, as far as right now, we don't have anything. But eventually, we might start doing our in own installs. I'm in Palm Beach. So eventually, I might start doing that and then have our own data to maybe give away if we're comfortable doing that. But we don't give away any previous clients' data or any current ones. How about installations? We can do your installations. Yeah, yeah. So um, that is definitely... We also do a track, So we're like a, actually a one-stop shop. So we work with a lot of right. solar companies as well, where they want to like get okay. a cost because now you know the the interest rates and everything is high. Yeah. So solar solar companies are trying to minimize the amount of panels the homeowner is getting to get the sale with with more energy efficiency by by giving them other energy efficiency adequate equipment like attic insulation or like hybrid water heating. Mm -hmm. um, or uh, air conditioning, like very 
efficient air conditioning units. So, um, you know, if you wanted to pass those installations or get involved in that, let me know. Okay, cool. Yeah, that's definitely something we can discuss tomorrow and then go over. Because there's a ton of different possibilities. Like, uh, we were talking as well, what we have is... Um, so I asked earlier, well, how many calls do you think you get a day? And that's because if you're missing 10% of the calls coming in, they're just going to go and call the next person. But what we actually have in this system that goes along with this review system is um, we are able to, let's say someone wasn't able to get to the phone. It automatically sends them a text message saying, hey, this is blank and blank, like from this location. Um, how can we help you? And then your receptionist or your team, whoever manages that can have that data where they're seeing those text messages come in and can respond to it. But what's even cooler is with this new AI, with OpenAI, you can actually attach OpenAI to it. So then it automatically responds to the people that are texting that missed their call, that you missed their call. So that's like an extra like four to nine percent. Like if you're getting 30 calls per month, for instance, that means if you were call missing three calls per month, and if each one of those calls was a solar deal, and you make five thousand off of that, a month you're missing fifteen thousand dollars, right? If you're just missing three calls, right? And that that a year is a hundred and eighty grand. So if you could add a hundred and eighty grand by adding a service that's like hundred fifty bucks, I mean, it's not the end of the world. Um, but that's one of those those things that we're able to implement for you with these a new AI technologies, which is super sweet. Um, but yeah, I, uh, I sent over that, uh, the Google meet. I'm not sure if you were able to get it. Yeah. Yeah, we got it. Okay, sweet. All right. All right. See you tomorrow. Awesome. Yeah. So I'll see you guys uh, tomorrow at 11 a.m and then we can further discuss these opportunities. Sounds good. Awesome. Thank you, Alberto. Have a good day. You as well.